Hi, this is Sarah Brin. Um, I'm the content, the head of content marketing for the show. And I want to tell you today a little bit about interlinking blog posts. Now, first of all, interlinking blog posts um, helps to um, help, helps users, the people who, who read your read your blogs to more easily navigate across your site to find similar content. It also helps search engines figure out what each post slash your site is about. So in this particular video, I'm going to just take a couple of minutes and just show you how I do that with um, with um, HubSpot topic clusters. So if you have HubSpot, um, great. It's a uh, you know, you may find that it that it's worth the money. If you don't, then I mean, heck, you can do topic clusters in a Google Sheet. You know, Google um, in Google Sheets, and just just you know, whatever's missing, that's what you need to write on, and then you know which which blog post you already have that you can link to. But I'm going to do it in HubSpot just so that you can see it. So I will log in and then go to marketing, planning, and strategy into SEO. And this particular blog post um, is actually a, a pillar post that we updated. Um, the original one was done in 2014. Um, this one, ooh, this just say 2014. Um, 2014, we just updated this um, and we're publishing it today, which is February the 6th, 2020. Um, so this post is about target marketing, figuring out who your target market is on social media or what is, uh, I mean, target marketing, target audiences on social media. Who, what is a target audience? We're going to talk about demographics and psychographics, with our, which are our secondary keywords. Um, so this is how it would go. So we're going to go to topics over here. And we know that it's a, I know that it's a pillar post. Like it's a, it's a, it's like a um, topic hub. So just click on target audience. And then I would come over here. Um, I actually just replaced this one with our new one because it was still our 2014, um, our 2014 version. And then the goal here is to, for whatever posts um, are already live, I want to find places to link this post back to my pillar post. So I need to find a place for sports, um, sports viewership. Looks like sports viewership is the, is the URL. So let me see. I know of a place actually who watch sports. Boom. There you go. And I'm going to link that sucker. HTTPS, uh, the shelf.com, the blog sports. Now, um, just just a, a side note. What what I typically do with with links is I'll let people know what they're linking out to. So in some of these, I'll say, um, you know, we pinned a, a series of posts uh, on strategy, so that so that when people click on it, especially if they're on their cell phones, they know that they're clicking to a post that we, we wrote, as opposed to something that's like, um, gosh, I don't, I don't see any here, but something that's linking out to a source which we also have. Um, so if it's linking out to a source, then I'll just put that in parentheses and I'll put the name of the source, like ad week or marketing land or, or whatever, and make that the link. So people understand that they're linking out to marketing land. Um, but otherwise I'll just do it that way. So that's basically all you have to do for each one of these. I want to find a place in a, a natural place, not like a weird way and make it, you know, like crammed with keywords or whatever, find a place in my post to, to embed these flip side. Once I'm done with that and I publish this, I need to find, um, I need to link all of these individual posts back to um, our pillar post so that it all kind of connects. So that's how you would do it with um, with HubSpot, like connecting, like doing the interlinking between the posts. You can just use your topic clusters or you can do the same thing, like I said, um, with Google Sheets and just make sure that whatever comes in here, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. We actually have another, it's another, okay, this is a secondary keyword. And then our published article is how to find your target audience on social media. And then once I have the time, I'll just go in and link all of these, like create these hyperlinks so that I can right click and copy the link. That's how you do it. I hope that helps you. Again, I'm Sorrel Brin. I am the, con the head of content marketing for the shelf, um, an influencer, influencer marketing platform. Um, if you have any questions at all, you can find me on, fa on Facebook. You can find me on LinkedIn. You can find me on Instagram. I'm everywhere. So I hope this helps. Bye.